<laughs> I was just saying. <laughs> Hi, Kevin. Um, I was just saying that I just saw the uh, go live notification um, that Brian wrote. The, in all caps, get us off of terrorists, oh my god, please, and it just made me laugh out loud right when I, you know, switched over to this scene, and uh, all I gotta say is uh, my hubs is something else, he is the eggs to my noodle, please, we earned it, <laughs> I'm working on it, I'm working on it, <laughs> All right, well, speaking of getting off of Terrace, where we left off is, uh, <laughs> thanks. What? Oh, hi, Brian. Um, so speaking of getting off of Terrace, last where we left off, um, I finally beat the crap out of Bendek. I finally beat the crap out of the Dark Jedi. And, um, after getting the codes to get off of Terrace, um, I then met with with this dude, whatever his name is, I don't remember his name, it's not gonna matter, um, <laughs> this dude, because he said that a guy named, uh, Davik has a ship to help us get off of Terrace. We just needed the codes so that, um, we could get past, uh, like, the Sith security, essentially, to get off the planet, since they're doing, um, a quarantine here of some sort. So... We are here now in, um, at Davik's estate, so we're basically, I guess, exploring right now in the estate, figuring some things out. I'd like to kill Davik personally, uh, to help with another bounty. <gasps> I forgot to turn in all of those bounties before I got here. <gasps> oh no! Well, we'll see what happens. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah. So, so, we are like, I feel like we're this close to getting off of Terrace. I just have like this other, I don't know what you want to call it, like dungeon crawl, because that's, you know, D&D terms that I'm used to. <laughs> and we'll see what happens. But anyways, um, we are going to do this, guys. We're going to get off of, ooh, med pack. Med pack. So, let's, let's take a look here. This is the hangar. That's where I came from a throne room that must be where i came from right because there should be another little like room or something oh no 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 it's down oh no this is the throne room oh duh that that totally looks like a throne <laughs> oh there's a guard right um i don't think all of these peeps are friendly with me so um are you gonna attack? No, you're not gonna attack. Okay, I'm just exploring. I'm the guest. Don't mind me. Whoa, hello. Flag spike. So we're gonna explore. Oh, that's not good. He just, he just, he just, uh, put up an energy shield. Um, I guess we're gonna fight our way through this place. No big! No big! Oh, I can we can we please do some damage? Do the damage. Plus. All the plus. That's right. I switched to melee to see if it would help with uh fighting then and it did because apparently melee weapons right now are like significantly stronger than any ranged weapon I could have at the moment. So but uh maybe you just like back here I that. Um and we're gonna keep exploring let's see let's see let's see what's this way oh good we'll start with this room you know what? I should be saving before you screw up this rate. Right? <laughs> uh, cuz. If I'm gonna be doing stuff like this, or if this is gonna keep happening, um, yeah. I should be a little bit prepared. Oh, there's another! I only saw one! Ooh. 
for me. Heck yeah. Okay. Alright. Okay. Uh, let me fix the desktop audio. Is that better? I can turn me up a little bit too. So far. Sounds good. Let me just check something here really quick. Okay. Eh. Do the thing. There you go. I turned the game down and me up. Are they coming after me? I don't think so. Oh, cause the door closed. Oh, nope, they're right there. Uh, nope. Can I have my friend back? This is a great start. Oh no, wait, I can just med pack right now. Uh, hold on. I should probably also have an energy shield up cause that's smart. Learning! Oh no, 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 no. No, we have grenades for this. Grenades. Do we have ion grenades? Yes! Just chuck that sucker over there. Boink! That didn't do nearly enough. <laughs> uh, I, let's do, let's do the Sonic. That should help. And then we'll do, like, two frags and see what happens. Oh, no, 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 don't get over to me. Oh, crap. Can you throw a grenade? Throw the grenades. What the heck? I told you to throw grenades! Throw more! Throw more! Uno mas! Yay! Okay, one down. <laughs> yeah, there's the other one. Let's see if I can just whack this thing. Boink! Fudge! <laughs> Boink! Do the thing! Ugh. There we go. Maybe I should re-equip my blaster. <laughs> Ooh, a cage release. Who is this dude? Hudbro. Yeah, sure, why not? I'm curious. Thank you. You have no idea what it was like in that torture cage. I don't know how much more I could take before going mad. Uh, yes, I want a reward. I used to be the, the Ebonhawk, Davik's flagship. I know the codes to disable the security system protecting it. I'll load them onto your data pad now. You can use oh, those codes to steal the Ebonhawk right out of its hangar. Sell it to the highest bidder, ransom it back to Davik. Whatever you do, you'll make thousands. Yes, that sounds great. Uh, okay, it see ya. It won't be long until Davik figures out I'm free. I have to get out of this base before that happens. That's not my problem. See ya. Have fun. We've got what we came for. We should get going. Is that all where I needed to go? Did I just happen to go in the right direction? <laughs> But I want to keep exploring. Ooh, a low security door. Let me save. <laughs> Let's do the saving. I want to do the exploring. Honestly. Let's see. Let's see. How dare you invade my chambers? How rude. I am a personal guest of Davik himself. Me too. Specific instructions that you guards were not to disturb me until morning. Oh. How can Davik expect me to invest in his ventures with this kind of incompetence on display? I should summon the other guards and report you to your commanding officer. Uh, you know, yeah, he just wanted me to make sure you didn't need anything. That, that's well, all. That's all. I can it's all good, guys. It's all good. Case. Tell Davik I admire a host who has his underlings check up on the well-being and comfort of his guests. Yeah. I don't require anything right now. You can tell Davik everything about my stay has been most pleasing so far. Here's a five-credit chip for your trouble, sir. Ooh. Yep, yep, yep. 
Yup. Now scurry on See back to If I find I have need of anything, I'll buzz you. Hmm. Until then, I expect you to respect my privacy. Yep. Sweet. Oh, good! Guess what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I'm really curious. Open. Ooh! I wonder if he'll get pissed off if I just take this stuff. If it, like, uh, triggers another cinematic or something. <gasps> 500 credits! Yay! Okay, see ya! That was good. <laughs> so I am extra, like, mercenary-like, I think, or, or I might be this game. Uh, cause I've been playing Assassin's Creed Odyssey now, recently, and I've been extra like, Oh, you want me to do this for you? Where's my reward? <laughs> Did I miss something? We are not on Terrace anymore. Technically we are! Um, we're at Davik's estate, so we, um, I'm with, I'm with What's-His-Face right here, uh, working to basically, I'm exploring the estate, we just picked up, uh, codes to the ship. And, um, that should be enough to basically get a hold of the ship and then GTFO off this planet. So I'm just kind of exploring the place right now. <laughs> and then we'll probably get off Terrace. <laughs> Hi, Marv! Ooh! That's a lot of people! Um... He, uh, 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 yeah, 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 I want that. Let's just do a few of those. Is that a plasma grenade? Oh, heck yeah! Oh, my dude died. Oh, I killed him with a plasma grenade. Oops. Uh, so, you know. I'm just throwing grenades because I don't want to fight melee when I can't, don't really- Oh, I need a med pack! I'm good, I'm good, I got this! As long as I have grenades, I can do this. <laughs> oh shoot, was there another guy behind me? Okay, this guy should be dead. Oh, he is dead. Yay! Let's, um... What do I have? Are you... No, you're... Uh, 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 let's do an ion grenade, because I have that. Uh, I'm out of grenades now. Crap! Let's just, uh... Okay. Eh, sonic grenade, go! Oh, that sonic grenade was good! Throw, throw another. Throw another. Throw another. Oh good, he dead now. Yay, I did it. 23 credits. Dude, get a grip. <laughs> oh, I didn't heal him last time. Oh no. Yeah, I think I'm gonna switch back to my uh, blasters now because, um, because I wanna. <laughs> this was a good idea to use this thing uh, against Bendek because it did do more um, more damage, but should be fine now. What? You, yeah, well, shut up. Take this. Have another. This is great. I'm, I'm out of med packs now. Yay. Um, so let's let's get my blaster back. You can. Oops. What did I have? I had the... Here we go. This is what I had. Okie dokies, all good now. Are you not using blasters anymore? Uh, it was... So I was giving it more of a shot, but after these last two fights, I wasn't really enjoying it as much because I, I obviously kept missing since I'm not as proficient. Um, but, uh, it was, I had it for when fighting Bendek in the last, 
stream so I could go be able to be more like one-on-one -on, -one on him I guess uh, plus I don't understand why melee weapons do so much more damage right now in comparison to any of the ranged weapons I can currently get um, but that's neither here or there we're going back to this cuz I wanna and now I'm out of grenades <laughs> what's behind this door oh that's not Good. Maybe I should stop opening doors. Um, I should probably stop opening doors. Yes. Yeah. Why do you have so many dark side points? Because that's just what's happening. <laughs> oh, these guys are really easy to kill. Huh? Where are you going? Uh, are you are you attacking the same person? No. I want you to attack this guy. I'm here. Aha! This is fine. Ah, yes! And now my master uh, sniper shot can potentially, like, stun people. And confuse them, so that's really nice to have. Yay! We're all good now. Huh? Now that must have hurt. Yeah, now this is the damage I want to see. That must have hurt. Now that must have hurt. Now that must have hurt. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Do you have med packs? Repair kits? pack Let's take that now oh first aid more med packs awesome did i take it yes i did awesome um let's see what else what else what else what else oh i gotta loot this guy uh okay should be good and what's over here And how are you guys doing today? I'm so excited it's Friday. Ooh, this is a long hallway. Looks like... Looks like I'm kind of looping back to where I was. What's this place? Let's check my map here. Yeah, kinda. So I took... Ah, guest room. That was the torture chamber. Barracks. Uh, yep, because I came from the throne room. Yep, okay. So let's just keep going this way. Hi! Where's my companion? Why is he not attacking? Oh, you're right there. Oh no, I'm glitched. That was weird. Now that I was weird. Okay. Now that must be. Now that must be. Good to know there's another now guy on, on the other side. <laughs> character! Character! Why are you jiggling like that? Oh my gosh, I can't target him. Okay, can we- can you move? Can you not do the- yes, I'm aware. There we go. That was weird. Oh, you're busy. Okay. Uh, I'm pretty sure someone someone has loot. No? No? Why not? Ooh, what's this? Ooh, a security terminal. Let's take a look. How many spikes do I have? <gasps> 20 computer spikes! Heck yeah, this is the most I've ever had! Alright, uh, yes, we're gonna... Oh, but I have the access card. Let's just, you know, whatever. Security cameras. Let's take a look. Ooh, a spice lab? Spice lab, throne, storage, hangar. This is another camera. Oh, there's a barracks to the spice lab, a barracks to the throne room. 
Interesting. All right, well, where's the spice lab? This looks fun. Oh, there's no one there. Oh, because that's the barracks. Gas the room? <gasps> what? There's no one in there! Aha, but there are peeps in there. Gas the room? Oh my god, that sounds terrible! I don't think I have the heart in me to do that. Woo! I actually forgot which day today is because of lockdown. Oh! <laughs> that happens! Oh my god! I don't... That sounds terrible! Yes, okay, where, what's, what's the spice lab? Whoa! Alright, let's go back. What's in system commands? Ooh, I, ooh, disable hangar security is probably a good idea. And it doesn't cost spikes, so I feel like might as well. Um, let's do that. I can open all the security doors, but I've got enough of a security skill to do that. Um, plus it helps me keep track of what I've opened already and what I haven't. Uh, area schematics, that's alright. Return to root menu. Um, oh my god, I didn't, I never thought you could, like, guess a room. <laughs> that sounds terrible! Uh, okay, we're just, we're done now. That This is fine. I, I disabled the security hangar, or the hang, security for the hangar, so we're fine. This is fine. <laughs> that's good enough. That, like, really shocked me! <laughs> I assume the hangar's where I want to end up going, but whatever. Barracks. Barracks. Is that where I came from? Oh, no, I came from... Wait. Yeah. I went... Yeah, because here's the throne room. Oh, did I go? I did not go up here. Ah, uh, oh, duh. I was like, hello. <laughs> All right. I can't move. Man, glitchy game. Why? Now that must have hurt. Can you attack the same person, please? Okay. Why do you have to go right in front of him? You're a sniper! Okay, whatever. Yeah! Stuff! All the stuff! Oh. Oh, that's fine. Now that must be. Yeah, you get in there, Candors. It's, 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 or whatever your name is. It's fine. I'm sure it's safe. Oh, another security this terminal. Oh! Oh, you blew him up. Okay, you're fine. Everything's fine. I wonder if I'm about to run into Davik pretty soon. Uh, let's save. Hello? Oh! Can you recover a mine? You're gonna try it. Recover this mine, please. Yeah. What? Oh, you did it! No, you didn't. You did not. You totally failed, and somehow it did huh? not blow up on you. Do it again. You're fine. What? Everything's fine. We killing everyone in Davik's ship now? Yeah, kinda. <laughs> I guess. Why not? <laughs> At least it gives experience. <laughs> Maybe that's why I'm just killing people. I get. I do it for the experience. <laughs> the experience points. The exp. The exp. Okay. Uh. All right. We'll go the other way now. 
Uh, that was my... Ooh, what's in here? Didn't I come from here? Yeah, okay. Do, 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 do. Um, oh, right. These were, this was the first room I opened last stream. Ooh, stuff! And killed people. Okay, we're good. Let's keep going over this way. Ooh, low security door. Totally got this. Oops. On it. Done. Uh... Let's ask some questions. Alright, so I'm going. Bah. Oh, oh, excuse me though while I. <laughs> Just take your stuff. Next. On it. Done. Ooh, that, uh, that, what is that? Is that a Rancor head? Ooh, that one was locked. Ooh, these both are locked. I wonder if it's trapped. On it. Done. Clearly not. Ooh, a hair trigger? Is that like an upgrade item? On it. Done. Done. Ooh, 100 credits. Ooh, a data pad. Ooh, I'm curious. What is this data pad? Should I have gone this way first? Because I feel like... <laughs> Since I already found what I needed, technically. <laughs> uh, where's my items? No, no. I will one day learn this interface, I promise. I promise. Where am I, here we go. Uh, show new items. Where's that data pad? Here we go. Uh, a record of Kalonord's trophy kills. Ah, yes. A Rancor. The last entry is an account of a recent Rancor hunt. What the Rancor lacked is n intelligence it made up for in size, strength, and ferocity. Conventional blasters were all but useless against its impenetrable hide. And I was forced to resort to more unorthodox methods to bring the beast down. Some well-placed mines near a watering hole were the first step. Their explosions hurting the creature into a dead-end can... Canyon? Is that a typo? That can- Whatever. Where I lay in wait. Uh, perched among the rocks. As soon as the rancor was below me, I dropped down onto its massive neck. It reared back, bucking and clawing in an effort to dislodge me, but I had the perfect position. Unable to shake me, the monster opened its mouth in an outraged howl, and I was able to flip several flag- Fragging your grenades <laughs> down its gaping maw. The explosion blew me clear off the shredded corpse, but luckily the head was still intact. If I take it to Terrace, I'm sure Davik will mount it in his trophy room along with the other heads I have collected for him. This is long. Davik also expressed interest in hiring me. I may take him up on his offer, even though I still have yet to claim the greatest hunting trophy of all. A pearl from one of the crate dragons of Tatooine. All right, so if we need to know how to kill a Rancor again. Oh, wait. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I wonder, that is kind of what we did to an extent uh, with um, the, the Rancor we first ran into, so. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm about to run into Davik here pretty soon. <laughs> and that might be... I see we're still on Terrace. We're getting there, Matt! We're getting there! I am exploring Davik's estate. I have the codes to get to the ship and everything. I am just... I just... I am... I am working on it. <laughs> oh! Hello! Welcome to the slave quarters, fair mistress. 
I mean no disrespect, but perhaps one of the male slaves could serve your needs better. Right. We pay taxes here. <laughs> not for long. No, 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 no. We do not pay taxes here. You guys. Okay, well, I think I've explored everywhere now. So, uh, out of total curiosity, what is he going to tell me? Welcome to this lake. Oh, it's an actual place. conversation. Here we have succulent fruits and berries to tempt your palate, as well as luxurious baths to soothe your aches and pains. Would you like a relaxing massage, mistress? Whatever your desire, we are here massage to serve. Massage sounds pretty great. I'd love a massage right now. <laughs> I'm kind of tempted. <laughs> oh, no, it's fine. I'll be going now. Return whenever you wish to partake of what we offer here. We exist only to serve. Fine. No. Uh, ooh, a bath. I like taking baths. Okay, I think I've explored everything. Right? Yep. Looks about right. Alright, time to go to the hangar. I probably... Let me get a med pack. There we go. That should help. Do 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 do! Let's go, let's go! Oh, hello? Oh, you're the security terminal. Okay. Wait, I didn't find the spice lab. Barracks, barracks, throne room, guest room, more barracks. Oh, I did find the spice lab. <laughs> Never mind. I guess I did. <laughs> Hangar bay. Okay, let's save here. It just makes me think of Critical Role with, do you spice? <laughs> Damn no shit, they're bombing the whole planet. I knew they'd turn on the sooner or- Wow, look what we got here. Thieves in a hangar. Sup? So, you figured you'd just steal my shit for your getaway and leave me high and dry while the Sith turned the planet into dust? Sorry, but that ain't gonna happen. I'll take care of them, Davik. I've been looking forward to this for a long time. Oh, have you now? Follow the Sith mean business. If we don't get to our ships and find somewhere safe, the bombs they're dropping will kill us all. Ooh, I wish I had Bastila with me. I don't like this. <laughs> I have no grenades. Um. Go! We'll start with him first, because I have a feeling he's going to be more of a problem than Davik. But I could be wrong! Let's Come see on. what happens. You know what? Davik did a good idea. Let's do an energy shield. <laughs> and uh, then we'll blast Kalo. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, this isn't good. Can we... What happened? <gasps> oh, I'm about to die! Um... That's not good. I'm down. Okay. Let's try that again. Uh, I didn't hit them at all. That's lame. What med pack? I have five med packs, so that's good to know. I should watch my health better. Uh, energy shields are always a good idea. And, um... I do have mines, but I don't think I can throw the mines. Let's, uh, okay, let's just try again and see. Damn no shit, they're bombing the whole planet. I knew they'd turn on the sooner or Oh, look what we got here. Thieves in a hangar. So, Hello. I figured you'd just steal my shit for your gallery. Oh. I can usually click through the uh, arena conversation to skip, but I can't skip this one to just get to the fighting. Take care of them, Davik. I've been looking forward to this for a long time. Make it quick, Carlo. The Sith mean business. If we don't get to our ships and find somewhere safe, the bombs they're dropping will kill us all. Uh, maybe I'll try to kill Davik first and see if that does anything different. Do you have anything? 
Uh, let's give you... Why not? Let's do that. And then shoot the crap out of them. What? Oh my god, that's not working at all. Why well, told you to fight this dude? Um, 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 alright, you do that. Hold on, you need a med pack. <laughs> No, 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 no. Med pack. Yeah. Ah, okay. That's not good. Yeah. I don't know why. Is he just not targetable? I don't even. He lost barely. He, he lost a little bit of health. Oh no! Okay, um, let's give you a, a med pack. Because, I guess, why not? Or not. I better be able to beat these guys! Where's my Jedi friend? Alright, you know what? Um, I wonder if there's anything in... Uh... I'm curious. I wonder if there's anything in the hangar that can, uh, help. But now I'm wondering... I disabled the security in the hangar. Is there a, something else I can do on this terminal that could help with that fight? Because it seems, seems suddenly, like, really hard. <laughs> Access card. What's in system commands here? No... Can I see the hangar? Here we go. I don't see anything. Other than the ship. Where is Bastila the kill machine? I know! I need her! <laughs> I need her! Uh, uh, okay, I guess there's not much. Well, let's go back in. Maybe I'll run around the room this time and actually see if there's something that may help. <laughs> Instead of just stand there and take the hits. Damn no shit, they're bombing the whole planet. I knew they'd turn on the sooner or oh, Look what we got here. Thieves in a hangar. So, you figured you'd just yeah, 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 my yeah. ship for your getaway and leave me high and dry while the Sith turn the planet into dust? Honestly, I don't know if you can but beat this fight with happen. only two people. Well, I only you. have these I've two people. I've been this for a long time. Sip mean business. If we don't get to our ships and find somewhere safe, the bomb You could have a third, but I think all. you had to bring them in at the bar. I had Bastila and T3 with me in the bar. And then and then we came out, and then once I got to to here and talking with this dude, he was my only party member. I don't I feel I'm pretty sure I was forced to only have two people. Um, I have two grenades. Oh, no, wait. Do that. Two grenades. Maybe I'll be able to stun you. Uh, you, you just attack the living poo out of this guy. I just played this part and had cart with me. What? I'm here. Well, that's the most damage I did on Kalo now. Grenade spam? Those those two grenades were my last two grenades because I spammed them on other things. <laughs> so, uh, I did that earlier. Eh, I don't want you to do just normal attacks. Be, do it the improved blast. Yeah, oh, it is right. Oh, no, wait, you need, you need a, um... A med pack, a med pack. Do a med pack. Let's do two, just in case. No, you only need one. And then, and then keep attacking. And then, you're okay so far. Maybe I can stun him. Come on, come on. You guys can do it! 
one round in a fight I can not hit for anything and then in another round I can constantly hit and things are actually fine <laughs> that is wild to me like I understand it's kind of the d20 system but a little consistency would be great <laughs> um I think that's everything so I better get on board yes uh, yes, I want to board. Let's get this ship fired up. We'll pick up the rest of your friends and then we'll yeah, have to yeah, get yeah, off yeah, this Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty, like, it had me, like, forced to pick to have this guy. And maybe I accidentally clicked, like, yeah, this is enough people in the party or something. But to me, it seemed like it was, <laughs> it was forced. <laughs> But I got here, so... <gasps> Wait, did we leave Terrace? Are we off of Terrace? <gasps> Are we off of Terrace? Terrace is defenseless against our assault, Lord Malak. They are offering no resistance. The city is in ruins. Resume the bombardment, Commander. Wipe this pathetic planet from the face of the galaxy. We're off of Terrace! We're off of Terrace! We're off of Terrace! I see a little bit of my green screen right here. Eh. Hey, hopefully that helps. Oh man. Well, there goes the, the guy that I could have, like, cashed in the rest of my bounties to. Bye! I, you did it! I did it! Thank you! <sighs> That's what you guys get for not believing in me! Off of Terrace. And where are we going next? Right. Well, that's an adventure. Plot a course for Dantooine. There's a Jedi enclave there where we can find refuge. Incoming fighters. They took her <laughs> ship. <laughs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> they took that hashtag way too seriously. <laughs> So I'm going to Dan Tween now, not Tatooine. There, there are there are different Tweens, Tween planets. Can't wait for the next planet. That does that doesn't seem. Is that supposed to bode well? Dan Tween. So there, I never heard of. What am I doing? Bang, bang, bang. What am I doing? What do I do? Oh, 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 oh. Hello, there you go. I see you, I see you. Oh, you you exploded. Gah! Go, 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 go. Oh my God, I can't hit. Maybe he's too far. Where's another, oh, 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 hey, you, yeah, you. Hey, hey, get back here. Where's that coming from? I can't move my mouse! This, oh, I can use the keys. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. This is fine. Uh, where? Oh! There you are. Get back here. Get back here. You dick! Get back here! I see you. Yay! Did I do it? No, I think I'm dying. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> Oh my god! Get him! Go! Oh, this is why I don't play shooters!
Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I see you! I don't- I really don't see you, but I can hear you! Get- I can't get any lo- oh, 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 oh! There! Did I do it? Okay, I'm alive. <laughs> <laughs> Dantooine, Tatooine. There, there are too many Ooines, Ooine planets. I've never heard of Dantooine in my life. Hey, it's my Jedi friend. Dantooine. Seems like a lifetime since I last set foot on her surface. Though in truth, it's only been a few months. We should be safe from Malak here. For now, at least. Safe? You saw what his fleet did to Terrace. There wasn't a building over two stories high left standing. They, they turned the planet into one big pile of rubble. Even the Sith would think twice before attacking Dantooine. There are many Jedi here, including... Don't forget Klaatooine. What? There's <laughs> great strength within this place. Oh, I think Karth has a point. We should keep moving. I actually agree with him. We can't just keep running. Malak will find us Oh, eventually. man. We need my to body is stiff. My plan. back. Here and my, the we back of my neck and my shoulders. Oh, it's all so Something stiff. All <laughs> Gotta do some right. yoga. It isn't easy to witness the annihilation of an entire planet. I know Meshin must be taking it pretty hard. She will find a way to come to terms with her grief. She's stronger than she appears. We just need to give her time. Now I must go speak with the council. I need their advice on recent developments. After I've met with them, I'll meet you outside the ship. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Okay, okay, sounds fun, sounds fun. Oh man. Look at that pixelation. I'm sure it looked really good back in the day. I've spoken briefly with the council. They request an audience with you. We should go at once. An audience with the Jedi Council? It's pretty unusual for someone who isn't even a Jedi. What's this about, Bastila? I'm sorry, Karth, but I cannot tell you. All I ask is that you trust in the Force and the wisdom of the mm. Council. Trust well, like in left out of the, the loop, Force. But I'm not looking to get you in any trouble with the Jedi Masters. We'll do things your way for a while. Come, they're expecting us. I will lead you to the council chambers. Until you have talked to the Jedi Council, you'll be unable to switch characters in and out of the party. Alright. Alright. We meet more kill machines called Jedi. <laughs> yeah. Padawan, why are you not wearing the customary robes of the Jedi? Do you mock the honored traditions of our order? Do I look like a Jedi or a Padawan to you? Uh. Yeah, we'll do Bastila. that. I have heard of her. A do I look? <laughs> do I look like a Padawan to you? You see this giant Sith sniper and rifle I'm carrying? You. you claim you are not a Padawan? I find this hard to believe. The Force is strong within you. I can feel its presence. Ooh, if this the is Force is strong with jest, this one. It is in very poor taste. The Jedi Order is not a subject for jokes. Okay. No wonder Bastila was mean. They're all mean here so far. I didn't come here to be scolded by you. I suppose you did not. I apologize. Mm -hmm. Please forgive the abruptness with which I first greeted you. It was harsh and perhaps unfair. My master often warns me that I must learn to control my emotions. The I Jedi suck. suck. <laughs> I wish you a pleasant stay here on Dantooine. May the Force be with you. Uh huh. Uh huh. Great. Now I lost my friends. I don't see them. See, you delayed me. Where am I going? Oh, hi, Karth. What's up? 
Oh, are you waiting right there? Is the Jedi Council? Ah, oh! So you are the one who rescued Bastila. It is appropriate. Oh, see, they get it right. I rescued Bastila. Case. She still John, doesn't believe that. A member of the Jedi Council. We Whoa! Let's Master not jump Hope, to conclusions. Master Vandar, and of course the chronicler of our academy, Master Dorak. Padawan You're not Master, completely sure wrong, you though. <laughs> Oh god, I wasn't paying attention. I was watching a uh, reading chat. Uh, I'm sure you are already familiar with it. Oh, Padawan Bat- You're a Padawan?! What?! I thought she was not a Padawan. Okay. I had to rescue a Padawan. Oh, okay. Um. Um. Isn't the Jedi Council on Coruscant? Yeah, sure, I'll ask that. Yes. Why not? The High Council of the Jedi Order is on Coruscant, but we are <laughs> the of the training facility here on Dantooine. Oh no! <laughs> what do you want from me? Yep, that's 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 the question of the day today, isn't it? Bastila tells us you are strong in the Force. Oh, I keep playing with my hair. My bangs are so training. long. There you go. I'm using like <laughs> my headphones is like using. The end of my hair for placement! There we go. Okay, what? What? You are strong in the force. We're considering you for Jedi training. I I don't know. You know what? I don't I don't think I'm up for some Jedi training. Nothing would give me greater honor than learning the ways of the Jedi. However, actually, if I can be as strong as Bastila is, though, in this game, then then I would really consider it, because that would be a lot of fun. Mm, now I'm torn. Is this like a really big choice? Oh no, I don't know if I'm ready for this. Do not worry. I am confident in your ability to learn. Master Jar speaks out of turn, perhaps. We need indisputable proof of your strong affinity to the Force before we would even consider accepting you for training. Oh. Surely the entire council can feel the strength of the force within this woman. And I've already related to you the events that took place on Terrace. Perhaps it was simple luck. We both know there is no luck. There is only the force. We all feel the power in Bastila's companion, though it is wild and untamed. Now that this power has begun to manifest itself, can we safely ignore it? The Jedi training is long and difficult, even when working with a young and open mind. Teaching a child is hard. How much harder will it be for an adult to learn the ways of the Jedi? Uh... Oh! Oh! Look at these choices! Okay, I'm willing to try my best. I'm ready to accept the training, and my age has nothing to do with it. That sounds like something I myself would say. <laughs> <laughs> age is only a mark of time nothing more nothing less it means nothing um but that i'm not going to get into that i actually read a whole article about that never mind moving on uh of course great jedi i will learn your ways and follow the light legally <laughs> um i guess i'll do number two let's lie yeah i'm like i'm like uh now nah, I'm gonna do number two. Number two. Age has nothing such to do with pride, it. Such arrogance. <laughs> this one is already on the path to the dark side. As are many who oh, are not I given am. proper training, Master Vrook. Oh, I am. Guns, I have lots of dark can points. Can we hope to lead those <laughs> who have strayed back to the path of the light? Traditionally, the Jedi do not accept adults for training. Though there are rare exceptions in the history of our world. Good, kill them now. Do it. <laughs> I agree with Master Dorak. Many of our own pupils are leaving the Jedi Order to follow the Sith teachings. We need recruits to stand against Malak. With Revan dead... Are you certain Revan is truly dead? What if we undertake to train this one and the Dark Lord should return? We should discuss this matter more fully in private. Bastila, you and your companion must go. This is a matter for the Council alone. As you wish, Master Vandar. We shall return to the Ebon Hawk and leave you to your deliberations. Oh, okay. I think. 
cool. Is this a nightmare? Or is this another vision thing? I mean, I guess technically since I'm asleep, it's just called a dream. But you know, whatever. Whatever. The dark side is strong in this place. I can feel its power. Is this wise? The ancient Jedi sealed this archway. If we pass beyond this door, we can never go back. The Order will surely banish us. Are the secrets of the Star Forge so valuable? Can its power truly be worth the risk? Secret of the Star Forge. The Star Forge sounds familiar. Is that mentioned in 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 the Old Republic? The MMO. Stranger by the minute. First Bastila comes out looking like she saw a ghost, and now you. Well, Bastila did mention that you should go to the Council Chambers before she left. It's no doubt urgent, so you shouldn't keep them waiting. Oh. All right. I had a rough I can't night. I blame you. I, I haven't exactly been sleeping well myself. Here, I thought things would get better once we escaped Terrace. Yep, all right, you let's go. It. Whoa! Oh, I can't pick Bastila. I'll take T3. Well, I'll take you too far. Yay! Wow! Oh my god, what is bothering you again what do you want what do you want yes what do you want uh Denton's do you know anything about this place? place it's all plains and herders and small settlements perfect for the jedi to lose themselves in i guess well that's all i can think of at any rate uh i just want to talk to you oh you want to argue some more is that it got this guy got this guy um I want to know. No, I don't want to argue with you. I, I, no, I don't this time. And I don't want to argue with you either. I mean, you seem sincere enough, I guess. I just don't trust easily. And for good reasons, which are my own. Oh, my God, it's another round robin of this again. Um... But we have to work together, Karth, so it has plenty to do with me. What reasons I want to know. Fine, you can stuff your reasons then. I can make you talk, Karth, trust me. Uh, I'm just gonna go with the first one. But we have to work together, dude! Like, come on, let's go! Oh, damn it. I suppose I won't get any rest until I talk, will I? You wanna know why I don't trust anyone? Fine. Oh, is he finally talking to Five me? Five years ago, the Jedi had just finished the war with the Mandalorians. Revan and Malak were heroes. I was damn proud to have served in their fleet. It was completely unexpected when they turned on us, invading the Republic while we were still weak. Nobody knew what to think, least of all me. Our heroes had become brutal, conquering Sith, and we were all but helpless before them. I mean, think about it. If you can't even trust the best of the Jedi, who can you trust? <laughs> what do I have to do with Malak and Revan? I mean... Uh, they turn to the dark side, obviously. Why is it so personal? I suppose you can't. That must have been hard to take. Uh, you know what? Yeah, I'm just gonna say I suppose you can't. That must have just been that must have been hard to take, just because I want to get farther along with this relationship with Karth to an extent and not keep having these two characters bicker with each other. <laughs> it wasn't even that. Th there were others. Good, solid men, trusted men who turned on us as well and joined their cause. Malak and Revan and the Sith deserve to die for what they've done, but the ones who fled the Republic and joined them are even worse. The dark side has nothing to do with why they joined with the Sith. They deserve no mercy. You say that with such hatred. I know, I know. And I should apologize to you. I've, I've become so accustomed to expecting the worst in others, and you've done nothing to deserve that. Ooh, it's just, I gave so some dark points myself, so... Uh, I'd rather not talk about it. His character of mine is not the most angelic person either. Okay, you good now, dude? 
Um, where am I going? Up, up this way. Oh, you leveled! Oh, good for you. Oh, whoops, I clicked on you. Uh, auto level up. Do that. Um, I will get to, uh, all the, like, gear and stuff I have, I will get to once after this. Well, this is kind of a more relaxing episode now, I think. <laughs> at least at the moment. I'm a bit more relaxed here on this planet, because I'm like, I'm off of Terrace. I'm off of Terrace. Oh, that's the training room. I'm going the wrong way. Sup, friends? Bastila has told us of a most unusual development. She claims you and she have shared a dream. A vision of Malak and Revan in the ancient ruins here on Dantooine. Oh. These ruins have long been known to us, but we believe them to be merely burial mounds. Perhaps they're more than we first suspected. If Revan and Malak found something there. Um. Yeah, I w that's what I was thinking. How would Bastila know if we shared a dream? <laughs> she says she has felt your presence within the dream. The presence she has felt within you ever since... Mr. Vandar. Ever since Taurus. It is not unknown for this to happen between two people strong in the Force. Bastila has described this shared dream to the Council in great detail. We feel it is more than a dream. It is a vision. The Force is acting through you as it acts through Bastila. Okay, I am having visions you and now. Bastila share a powerful connection to the Force and each other. This is not unheard of. Connections often form between master and student, but rarely does a No, do so not quick. tell me Whatever she's supposed to be my master in this. Uh, 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 no, no. <laughs> no, I do not want Bastila to be my master. Uh, we cannot ignore the destiny that has brought you and Bastila here to us together. Are you saying I'm joining? <laughs> what are you talking about? You and she are linked, as is your fate to hers. Together, you two may be able to stop Darth Malak and the Sith. But do not let your head be filled with visions of glory and power. Such thoughts are the path to the dark side. The way of the light is long and difficult, as you must learn. Are you ready for such hardship? I'm ready for whatever waits me. I will try my best. Of course, but I seek to follow the light. I am, I am lying. Look, she, she started as a scoundrel. I had the whole like mercenary survival of the fittest, the galaxy, the you know, I scratch window. your back, you scratch you mine kind of personality. Eye. So what? she's just Malachi living. <laughs> She's not necessarily a, a goody two shoes. Like animals, ambushing and assassinating our brothers wherever they are found. We fear it is only a matter of time until they discover even this hidden refuge. Other Jedi have fallen from the light and embraced the dark side, giving their allegiance to the Sith and Malak, their dark lord. Ah, uh, Jedi are turning to the dark side. The lure of the dark side is not easy to resist. <laughs> Malak's power grows as more, no, more planets it's not. fall to his conquering armies. If Malak is not stopped, the Republic will fall, and the Jedi will be hunted to extinction. The galaxy will enter a time of darkness and tyranny, not seen for a thousand generations. The Council has decreed that you and Bastila must investigate the ancient ruins you dreamed of. Mm. Once the Council deems you ready, Perhaps there you will find some clue, some explanation of how Revan and Malak were corrupted. And perhaps there you shall find a way Wait, to stop them. So once I'm ready, uh, yeah, I was going to say, I'm ready now. Let's do this. Because uh, I don't want to stick around here and like just do nothing, whether that's training or not. Yeah, I'm ready now. Let's go. Let's go. You like no student we have ever seen. But you're willful and headstrong. A dangerous combination. Mm. Before we send you to investigate the ruins, you must be trained in the ways of the Jedi so that you can resist the darkness within yourself, within all of us. 
Otherwise, you are doomed to fail. <laughs> we don't have time for this. You must learn patience and discipline. Ah, oh, I am not patient. I am not a patient the person. The side is strong there. We cannot risk sending you there unprepared. We must begin your training at once. You have a destiny upon you that you must be prepared to face. The entire fate of the galaxy is upon you. I can only hope you will prove up to the task. The path you have chosen to walk is difficult. Oh, I'm training Intensive now. Intensive training will prepare you physically for the demands I am of the training to be a Jedi. Meditation will teach you to channel the power of the Force. To truly understand the way of the Jedi, you must open your mind to knowledge. Seek wisdom in the teachings of the great masters of our order. The Jedi is never alone. Others in the order will always stand by you. You and Bastina share a special bond. Do not be afraid to turn to her when you need help in your training. <laughs> the way of the Jedi is difficult. It requires great discipline. Yet even though you are a mere apprentice, your potential is unlimited and your progress amazing. In all my years, I have never seen one who has mastered the initial training so quickly. I did it! You've done in weeks what many cannot do in years. Good. Uh, how long will the stream continue? We should, we'll be I going, um... Fully into the Jedi Order. We're probably going to go for another will end, hour. You will be granted the title of about another hour between uh, 7.30 and 8 o'clock Eastern, depending on what seems like a good stopping point. Uh, whoa, soon your apprentice ship will end and you will be granted the title of Padawan, the lowest rank of those within the Jedi Order, yet first you must prove yourself worthy of me. I don't... I was not expecting to become a Jedi in this game. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um. Wha You know what? What must I do to buy, to prove myself? The traditions and customs of our order, as handed down from master to pupil for a thousand generations, you must successfully complete three Ooh. tests before you earn your place among the Jedi. Let's do them. Let's go. Let's go. You have truly Let's go. the training you have been given, both mental and physical. Upon completing these tests, you will pass from apprentice to padawan and join in the ranks of the Jedi. First, I will test your knowledge of the Jedi code. Oh. These tenets <laughs> must always guide your actions in everything you do. You must always be conscious. I feel like in real life, you must I would be a terrible a Jedi. Jedi. <laughs> Return when you feel you are. I am for far challenge. from being patient. I am. How did I gain dark side points? Hold up! What did I do? What did I do? Oh no! Okay, I have more dark side points. <laughs> Oh, we became the thing we swore to destroy. You lied to them. Oh, I did lie to them. Right. Gotcha. 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 Uh, I'm doing what now? Um. Jedi Trials. Has decided to train you in the way after much initial training. Your first task will be to learn the precepts of the Jedi Code. This code is the path of... Okay. Um. Do I talk to you again? I wasn't paying attention. Greetings, I was reading chat. Your progress has. Uh, let's let's continue. Soon your apprenticeship oh. will end, and you will be granted the time in the traditions and customs of our order, as handed down from master to pupil for a thousand generations. Uh, right, right, right. I said I'm ready for this. We'll see if you have truly mastered the training you have been given, both mental and physical. Upon completing these tests, you will pass from apprentice to padawan and join in the ranks of the Jedi. Mm -hmm. First, I will test your knowledge of the Jedi Code. These tenets must always guide your actions in everything you do. Yep. You must always be conscious of their wisdom. Yup. You must now prove you have a Jedi's understanding of the Code. <gasps> oh, I think I was supposed to read it first. Of our order, there is no emotion. 
Oh fudge! I didn't study! I didn't study! I didn't study! Uh, peace is a lie. I'm pretty sure that- <laughs> There's no emotion. Uh... Was that a hint? Is it there is peace? Oh my god, I didn't- I- I should have wandered around to read, shouldn't I? Was there something I could have read to learn this? Oh no. Oh no. The- the- the academic in me is now freaking out because I don't know the answers! <laughs> There's peace! There is no ignorance. Um, 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 There is- there is knowledge! There is no passion. There is... Uh... There is no passion. There is... What are, are you doing the sit thing? Like, you're saying Pete, you're saying the opposite in chat of what he is saying in this dialogue. Um, there is no passion. There is... Serenity? There is no chaos. I think I failed this. <laughs> um, the the uh uh harmony. There is no death. Oh God, this is so bad. Uh, the force. You have learned your studies well, apprentice. It will not be long before you are a full member of our. Order. Oh, did I pass? But first, you must pass the second. <gasps> oh, I did it! And learn about the most prized <laughs> possession of a Jedi, the very symbol of our order. The lightsaber. The lightsaber <gasps> I actually the really want a lightsaber. <gasps> it is a symbol of a Jedi's skill, dedication, and authority. And each lightsaber is as individual as the Jedi who wields it. The blade is made of pure energy, focused by polished crystals in the hilt. As the second test, each Jedi must construct her lightsaber with her own hand. Ah! Now it is your time. I did this in Swotor. Master Dora. And he will guide you through the choosing of a crystal. The MMO. Hey, I guys, I did it! I did the first test and I didn't even study! <laughs> oh my god. I'm, uh, sweet. Let's make a lightsaber. Oh wait, what did he say to do? Speak to Master Doric. Okay, that's what I thought. You, which one are you? Not you. Nope, it's you. Ah, you have come, young apprentice. I, <laughs> I totally guessed. The best thing I, I was able to guess was like, okay, what's the opposite of what he's saying? Like, there is no chaos. All right, there's, there's serenity. No, what did I say? Something like that. Yeah, you, you know what I mean. <laughs> Time to choose the color of your lightsaber. The color also reflects the demeanor and position within the order. What colors are there? Blue is the color of the Jedi Guardian. This Jedi battles against the forces of evil and the dark side. They focus more on combat training. Oh, blue's my favorite color. Yellow is the color of the Jedi Sentinel. This Jedi ferrets out deceit and injustice, bringing it to light. They focus less on combat and more on other skills and abilities. Green is the color of the Jedi Consular. This Jedi seeks to bring balance to the universe. They mediate between other groups, using their powers Aww. to end conflict. And is this your first KOTOR playthrough? Yes, it is! Pretty obvious, isn't it? <laughs> Hi, PJ Chaos, how are you? Um, uh, okay, I'm, I'm between... So blue is my favorite color, so of course I always want a blue lightsaber, but I don't want to be a Jedi Guardian. Well, wait, I mean, but I've been pretty combat heavy this game, so maybe I should be a guardian. But normally, normally, uh, like the Sentinel and the Consular are pretty interesting to me. Oh, the Consular is another class you can play in the MMO, and that one is a fun one. That one I always like. Um, oh no, what do I do? Maybe I should just go combat heavy because that's what I've been doing in this game so far. Because I wasn't, you can change the color later if you want. 
oh, this is just all narrative and descriptive stuff. It's not gonna, like, have me be a specific class or anything. Even though I thought I already picked a class. <laughs> I'm gonna go blue. I like blue. No, it decides your class. Ah! Okay. Ah, uh, dang. Doing fine. This and the sequel are both excellent games. Yeah, I'm having a lot of fun with this game. You can always change the color, but this does decide your force class. Oh no! I need more information! Uh, so, mm, okay. So the consular was more about like being a mediator and, any, and everything. So that seems more like a, like a passive, like charisma persuasion type thing, right? And then the game won't give it. You would have to Google it or ask us. Okay, well, you guys are my Google right now then. <laughs> Uh, the Sentinels only said, like, different skills and abilities and more passive than combat, so I don't know exactly what that means. And Jedi Guardian just seems pretty combat-heavy, which I'm kind of leaning toward already just because I've been very combat-heavy in this game so far. Um, which is a total surprise to me because if I, if I knew that was gonna happen, I would have not picked the Scoundrel then. Um... But at the same time, I, I enjoy being more of a ranged fighter than anything. So, does, should that be Sentinel then? Like Sentinel or Consular? I only know Jedi Consular because of um, uh, Star Wars The Old Republic MMO. And that's like my favorite class in that. Uh, so, so if it's kind of the same vibe as the MMO to your guys' knowledge, that gives me a good idea of what the Consular does. Um, but the Sentinel is like, then I know nothing about. And I will now wait and stop talking to let you guys type if you are typing information. <laughs> I don't even know what the class does even though I have beaten the game. Oh! <laughs> um, oh man. My, my gut is kind of going sentinel. But I just, I just don't know. I'm the kind of person that before making a decision needs to know like all the information and everything. I am no help. I don't know, remember. No, you're good. You're good. Whoa, emotes. Hi, Liz. <laughs> Um, let's see, I wonder if, the issue is that if I, the, this game, because it's old, it gets finicky, so if I click outside of this, this game, um, it's going to screw up the stream, I promise you, it's weird. Honestly, I do not know the major differences. <laughs> um, you know what, I might just go Sentinel and see what happens then. Or you know what? Let me just let me just look it up on my phone, cause you know I'm smart. We we're in the technology world. We have so many different technology devices in our household. Uh, Jedi Sentinel, or no? Uh, yeah yeah yeah. Jedi Sentinel, uh, uh, Kotor. Wait, Sentinel is also a class type in in Swotor, but it was part of the. Uh, Guardian? No, it was part of the... Oh, jeez. Oh my god, there's so much. Okay, hold on, hold on. Hi, Lindsay. Hi, Liz! How's it going? This Reddit thread is saying Sentinel is not even worth it. <laughs> Um, oh, okay, hold on. How about KOTOR Jedi class for Scoundrel? What combos can I do? Don't think SWOTOR. Okay, well, that's the first problem. <laughs> uh, 
Uh... Okay, I'm reading that... Guardian is basically maximizing physical combat. The Consular is like a caster in comparison. And Sentinel seems to be a mix of both? Um... But you know what, if a Consular is more like a caster, then I think that's what I am going to do then. Which was kind of my gut anyway. So why not? Why not? Let's just, let's just do Consular because that sounds fun. <laughs> that sounds, that sounds great. Yeah, Guardian gives you the most health. Consular gives you the most force. Sentinel is halfway between-ish. Okay. Um, yep, then let's just go Consular because I'd rather have this person stay as a ranged attacker like she has been with like her sniper her and, and blasters and whatnot. So, Consular it is, and um, we'll see. We oh, see. what color was that? I it doesn't even matter. I I am sure I will change the colors multiple times. Gotta make sure the outfits and the lightsabers all match the same color and theme. They're menacing her with weapons, and she screams to you for help. What do you do? Guardian gives you the least amount of force. Oh no, I like force stuff. So yeah, we'll, we won't go Guardian then. A fraction of what Consular gives you. Okay, nope, then definitely force stuff. What did he say? A woman and her small child are this beset by a desperate looking group of thugs. They are menacing her with weapons and she screams to you for help. What do you do? Um, stop the thugs and find out why they are attacking her. Hmm. Indeed. <laughs> well, on to the next question. You are in combat Yellow is Sentinel. Oh, wait! Oh, so then Bastila is Sentinel then, because her lightsaber is yellow, right? Green is Consular. Okay, I can take that. My whole outfit is already green, so... <laughs> You're in combat with a dark Jedi allied with the Sith. Hey, I did this! Uh, there is a pause in combat. What do you do? Attack him again! <laughs> I mean, yeah, <laughs> I would. Um... Try to see a weakness in his technique. Yes. <laughs> I would do number three. Pick number three. I did as much. Now, the next question. There is a locked door, and your goal lies on the other side. What do you do? You pick the lock. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you pick the lock. I am beginning to see a pattern here, Apprentice. I hope I I'm doing this about right. what you would be best at. But first, the final question. You are the head of an enclave on a contested world. The Dark Jedi have infiltrated and are causing unrest across the planet. What do you do? Um... Ooh, try to lure them into a trap? That sounds fun. Yeah, let's do that. I would probably would hunt them down. Uh, but a trap does sound better. Oh no. Number three! <laughs> Number three, my lord! Hello! How are you doing? Is this Jedi just DMing his paddle? <laughs> oh, um, hunt them down or lure them into a trap? Hunt them down or lure them into a trap? I'm gonna hunt them down! Yes, I thought as much. Oh, did as you? I suspected you would be most suitable as a Jedi Sentinel. Oh, Which would I? What path do you believe yourself most suited to, Apprentice? Uh. <laughs> so, should I continue with Consular then, or should I actually go Sentinel? Because, <laughs> let's see. Let me see here. Mm. 
Strength, wisdom, and charisma are important. I don't know. You would be most suited not being here. Please leave. Should I listen to him or should I continue with the idea of being a consular? I don't... Uh... Whatever you want. Depends on what you want to be able to do. Kevin, hi. So... Ah! I have no idea. I am so indecisive. I just saw your message. Um, let me, let me take a look here really quick at all of these other deets. Go with Consular, more Force stuffs. Yeah, that's probably right. Be right back, I gotta feed dogs before Theo forks a hole in my eardrum. Aww. Don't listen to the Jedi. Alright, what? we're gonna go Consular. Boop! Here, Besides, Bastila is a sentinel your anyway. Follow your passion! LOL, the Jedi lies. It's a mind trick. <laughs> yep. Alright, consular it is! Whoa! Oh! Oh, skills! Okay, alright, alright. Let's do this. Let's do this. Um. Oh, I leveled. That's why. Let's do... I only have one point. Okay, so we'll choose wisely. Oh, thanks for the follow! I really appreciate it! What is it? Uh, Jer... Jermidi? Jermedi? Jermi... I think it's Jermidi? TV? Thank you for the follow! Uh... So let's do... Let's just... You know what? Um... Let's do Persuade, because that's always fun. <laughs> Feats! Oh, now I profit. Ooh, I got four stuffs now. I'm proficient in a lightsaber. <gasps> I want the double-sided one. That'd be so cool. That would be so cool. Jedi defense. That sounds great. Force focus. Jedi sense. Force sensitive. Okay. So what? Uh, let's see. What is this? I don't know what that is. So, okay, so I'm I'm building up more stuff on top of what I've already learned as a scoundrel. Oh, so this is kind of like a multi-class. Gotcha. So what is this? Force sensitive. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I need to read this stuff. Right? Oh, these are what I can... Gotcha. All right, what is this? Adds plus one attack bonus with blaster pistols. Blaster rifles. Uh, let's see. Adds one attack bonus with lightsabers. Adds one attack bonus with melee weapons. Oh, no. If I use a lightsaber, I need to get better with melee weapons? Or can I stick with a blaster? Ooh, blaster rifle. What is this? Advanced Jedi Defense. This feat gives a character a plus three bonus to all blaster bolt deflection rolls. Certain items may apply a bonus or penalty to this ability. This feat replaces... Ooh! Wait, this feat replaces the bonus given by Jedi Defense. Oh, I see. Okay. That would be helpful just because with my blaster rifle stuff, um, it lowers my defense when I do that specific move. So that's probably helpful. What is this? Improved critical strike. Armor proficiency. So... Can't do any of those. Blasters are so <laughs> uncivilized. I'm gonna- I'm gonna do the Jedi defense for now, and then, um... I feel like I'm just gonna have to experience Experiment the playstyle now with with how I want to do things. I don't even know. I don't even know. But whatever. Um, what is this? Force focus plus one to the difficulty class for all saving throws. Connection with the force that allows them to better sense incoming attacks. Grants plus two defense and is always active. Oh, that's fun. What is this? 
Uh, okay. Um, yeah. I'm probably just gonna do... Uh, advanced Jedi defense here. Because this is melee weapon and lightsaber. Well, um... Yeah, we're gonna do that. Add this feat. Okie dokies. Powers! Oh god. Oh, the force powers! Okay, this is what, uh... This is what, uh... Um... This is the stuff that Bastila has that came in handy. May the power of figuring it out as you go be strong within you! Thank you! I appreciate that, because... Oh no. Okay. Oh, I pick two powers now? Alright. Ooh, cure! That's the heal. Force aura. When this power is activated, the Jedi is temporary, temporarily granted a plus two bonus to defense and all saving throws. <gasps> That's cool. Burst of speed. Oh. Uh, Force Valor. So some of these I know that Bastila already has. And I'm probably going to keep Bastila, so I don't want to have the same things that she does. What is this? This power shields the Jedi in the Force, absorbing the first 15 points of bit damage from Sonic, Fire, Cold, and Electrical attacks. Damage over and above the first 15 points is suffered as normal. This effect lasts- <gasps> That's cool! Take healing, you will need it. Yeah, I probably will. I'm probably gonna learn... The Cure. Oh, there's more. Oh my god, there's so much more. Um, let me take- you have gained new powers, you must lose the add power. Oh my bad. There. Um what 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 is this? Affect mind. Healing in video games does tend to make things much easier. I run out of med packs so much, so yeah. <laughs> this will probably help. Uh affect mind enables persuasive use of the force. Once a Jedi has this power, extra options will appear in conversations as appropriate. Success is not guaranteed for extreme commands, or if the target is strong-willed, this power does not affect droids. Only the main player character can- Oh, that's cool! <gasps> that's cool. Um, Effect mine is nice for dialogue stuff. Yeah, I might do that, because I- I really- I- I made this character high on persuasion, too, so I really like the fact that she could just kind of further that with- with the force. What is this? Light side power. Wait, no. What? What are you? Oh, stun! Jeez, I can't read things. Stun. Stun droid. Wound. This power triggers spasms in the victim's lungs, causing great pain and inflicting two-thirds of the end. Ooh! A damage over time! That sounds fun, too. Oh, no. What do I do? Ooh, and a slow. Oh, God. Okay, um, so I'm gonna... I'm not gonna lie. I really want to do the effect mind on top of the cure. So I'm gonna do that, and then, um, I think I also really want... The wound sounds really fun, too. Um... So I might do things in addition, but... Yeah, this will work. Okay! I think I'm good now. <laughs> oh man, that took a bit. Oh, T3 now leveled! Oh, I think all of my peeps leveled. Because, yeah. Um, so let me, let me go to T3, just auto-level you up. Okay, you're good, you're good, you're good. Oops. Alright! So, um, I'm doing what now? I received my crystal. To become a Jedi Consular, you must return to Master Zar. Okay. There's force lightning? You tell me this now? What? Where? Hold up. Hold up. Hold the 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 There's force lightning? You were AFK. <laughs> no, it's all good. I'm happy with, uh, with Effect Mind and the heal. Depending on the supposed strength of stun, I probably would not have it affect lungs so much just as just cause discombobulation in muscles. Or perhaps cause signals from the brain and body. What? Oh, okay. I see what you're saying. 
That's true. Yeah, because I technically with my um, sniper shot, like my improved sniper shot or something, I have the chance to stun already. So part of me is like, if I can heal, and then if I can heal, and then I've got the potential stun, and then as long as I do damage, um, a, a dot, a damage over time, would pretty much be the next thing I would go for. Um, but I think, I think I'm good for now. I would have changed the fluff to something I think feels more normal. Can you learn this power? Not from a Jedi. <laughs> gotcha. Uh, okay, let's go back to what's-his-face. There he is. Ah, good. Now that you have selected your crystal, we shall begin the construction of your lightsaber. Yee! I get a lightsaber! I'm making a lightsaber. Uh, two to 16 damage, wow. You can't use force powers with an armor on if I remember right. Aw, uh, well, I have light armor? I don't know. We'll see, we'll learn. Oh, I think- I think that's all I can do. Okay, assemble! Oh, I have a lightsaber! Oh, how cute! Fun! Force speed is like haste, lets you take extra attacks and increased AC as well as faster movement. I did figure that one. Um, okay, I made a lightsaber. You have done extremely well in constructing your mm. lightsaber, Apprentice. Your crystal seems to have been set perfectly. It is rare indeed. And for yes, that you need Jedi or Sith robes to use lightsaber. many force powers. These crystals are ah. very rare, found only in certain caves. Do I do I need to wear something like else then to use the heal lightsaber. move I just learned? Or enhance its properties. There have oh no! Unconfirmed rumors of certain force-sensitive caves here on Dantooine that may hold these crystals. Uh, there are unconfirmed rumors of certain force-sensitive caves here in Dantooine that may hold these crystals. Oh, sweet! Um, should I know anything else? Your lightsaber identifies you as a member of the Jedi Order. With such recognition comes honor and respect and the attentions of dangerous enemies. The Sith and Dark Jedi will seek to destroy you, Apprentice. And you mm, must prove mm, yourself mm, worthy mm, in mm. battle against a foe who also wields a lightsaber. Are you ready to face the final challenge, Apprentice? Final challenge! Yeah, let's do it! For every Jedi, the threat of the dark side is always present. You must truly understand this before you are accepted into the Order. You must see the corruption of the dark side for yourself. Even here on Dantooine, there are places where the dark side holds sway, twisting and tainting nature itself. The ancient grove once used for deep meditation by the Jedi is now tainted. A wave of darkness perverts the region around it. The cat hounds in the area have become savage and ruthless. They have become a threat to the settlers, a threat the Jedi have promised to stop. Whoa. <clears throat> Uh, okay. My hell and I become seven years as they have stopped. Uh, what's causing this corruption? The cat hounds are but a symptom of the true problem. What you about if you were actually a Jedi, though? Any idea what you would take? My knowledge of anything new, Star Wars, is, your task. is very limited. In Star Wars, is very limited. I tend to think the mind power should be broken strong in real life in a lot of instances. Speed or mobility is ridiculously good, but healing. Would be maze balls as well. <laughs> Supernatural senses would be so strong too. Too feels bad, man. You could literally force your will on other people. That's OP. <laughs> yeah. Generally, I would probably focus on enhancing my physical attributes or precognition. Although the ability to create illusions is cool, but telepathy is cool too. Whoa, conversations much. Uh, what? Um. You know more than you're telling me. I can say no more. 
some things you must see for yourself. None of the other Jedi at the Academy are permitted to help you in this task. Oh, remember this does that mean I can't have Bastila? A Jedi acts with patience and care, and those on the dark path are not always lost forever. The dark side still taints the ancient grove. Your lessons cannot continue until the spreading corruption of the dark side has been stopped. This is your task, Apprentice. May the Force be with you. Hmm. Huh? All right, let's do this. Let's go, let's go. I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> T3, move your butt. Where am I going? Where is this? To outer courtyard. Aerotech Mercantile. I guess I'm going out that way, right? You must cleanse a meditation grove to the southeast of the dark of the dark taint that has been infesting it, the exact nature of this. Okay, yeah, so I'm going yeah, that way. Ads are up for me, so have not been able to hear or see what's going on. Oh no! The ads! Oh, look! A sub! <laughs> Yay! Thanks for gifting the sub! It's locked. I am not supposed to go here. Talk to you. Hello? The council has decreed you may come and go as you please. Oh, okay. I've been, I've been decreed. If I ask about something you've already been said, that would be why FYI. Oh, no big. I love that gif, isn't it? Yep, we finally got rid of the zombie gif because we kept forgetting about it. So, <laughs> yeah, we finally, we finally changed it. Like we've been meaning to for like two months now. Whoa, what is your problem? Yes, what's on your mind? I thought I said I don't want to talk about it anymore. Listen, sister, just because we're working together doesn't mean you get to go badger me with constant questions. Look, the game keeps telling me you seem bothered and then this happens, okay? I am just trying to help. Uh, do we have another problem now? Arrested. If you aren't the most frustrating woman to talk to, isn't there someone else you can harass for a little while? Oh my god, I'm frustrating. Look who's talking. Me? What did I do? Sister? <laughs> I know, I did not, I did note that he called me that. Because what? You don't know, typical male? Oh, I could make this so bad. <laughs> Never mind, I'll leave you alone since I'm so frustrating. Wait. I didn't mean it that way. Don't go, damn it. Look, I suppose I could use someone to talk to. I'm just not used to it, and I don't know why you're so interested, but here goes. When I think of all the men who betrayed us, the one that stands out above all of them is the one that I respected the most, Saul. You say a name like I should know it. <laughs> he does. I thought everyone did. But Admiral Saul Carath is the commander of the entire Sith fleet. He's half the reason Malak has done so well in the war. Saul was my commanding officer back when the Mandalorian Wars first began. Oops. He taught me everything about being a soldier, and I looked up to him. Saul approached me before he left. He talked to me about how the Republic was on the losing side and about how I should start thinking of my survival. I know now that he was trying to recruit me into the Sith, but I couldn't have conceived of it back then. I, I argued with him, and he got angry, and he left. I never saw him again. Whoops. Uh, you didn't think he would betray the Republic? Saul was my mentor. He led us to so many victories against the Mandalorians. Even when things looked to be at the worst. I gotta sit back. I just, I couldn't conceive of it. Gotta relax. He, he couldn't be serious. Scoot that in. was wrong, of course. He not only left us for the Sith, he, he gave them the codes to bypass our scanners. I remember waking up as the first of the Sith bombers snuck past our defenses and began destroying half of our dock ships. I knew right away what had happened. Whoops! stopped him, I could have stopped it all. Ow. <laughs> my knee hit my drawer. <laughs> uh. 
I could have stopped him, I could have stopped it all. So you blame yourself for trusting your friend. I blame Saul, not myself. I was, I was stupid and I ignored the danger. He nearly destroyed us all. No, I fought Saul for years now and if I ever catch up to him, he will regret what he's done. He will regret it. Um, I'd do the same thing in your shoes. Well, there's more to the story, I guess. Oh, jeez. I don't want to talk go. about it right now. Let's go. Oh, my God. Okay. Hey, that reminded me, though. Uh, <laughs> you have, you have, uh, I got, I need to go through all of this, this new gear we got. Uh, let's see, let's see. I cannot wear this war suit. I bet Karth can. Or public mod armor. Gotcha. All right, Karth. Karth. Uh, where, where, where? Oh my God! Where do I? Here we go. <laughs> you can wear this. Six max dexterity plus three. Okay, but the defense bonus is definitely. Ooh, resistances. Heck yeah, that sounds great. Um. Okay. You have two blaster rifles. Oh, and what is this? A cardio regulator. A power belt. Oh, strength. Saves fortitude. Um. Saves fortitude plus three, so that's an upgrade. You have tons of energy shields. What is this one? Deflection energy cone. <laughs> Oh, that's fun. Duration 200 seconds for the maximum much charges using the... Oh, I want that. You can cancel it. You've got that. Whoops, you can't wear that. Oh, sweet. Will. Bonus feet improved power blast. Does he know that already? I don't know. Do you know that, Karth? Well, I'm not keeping up with chat. If I'm gonna have ads pop up, I want the streamer to be paid for it. Twitch has more than enough money <laughs> targeting small streamers with ads. Makes it even harder for them to take off. Yeah, that sucks. Ouchies. People make mistakes for as hell. Unless you're a super genius, you're a gamble you're a gambler, aka come join the regular people. <laughs> yeah. Um What oh, your feet. Let me see your feet. Improved power blast. You do know this already. Okay, so I'll give that to me. You, what is this? <clears throat> Maybe you can take what I have. Okay, so let's just go back. That gives you awareness. All right, let's, you take that. Karth can take this, this, eh, there we go. And then I also want uh, one, this one. Yeah. I did not check his weapons. Oh, do I have the lightsaber now? Oh, I do. Why do I feel like... Oh, no. Okay, we'll see. Man. All right. Do I have to have this lightsaber equipped? I like... I like my rifle. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Um, you have a heavy blaster equipped. So 1 to 8, 1 to 6, 1 to 8, 1 to 4. Cancel. Heavy blaster, Karth's blaster, 2 to 7. I guess you can hang on to that. Alright, uh, oh, T7, what do you have? Bendex blaster is 2 to 7. Fine. That's fine. Then what's this? Heavy blaster. Okay, I think everyone's got level two. Shield disruptor. Flamethrower. Plating type, plating type. That's the same thing. Probe, nothing here, nothing there. Okay, I think that's everybody basically. So, okay. Whoa, why are you, why are you pointing guns at each other? Hmm? <laughs> he looks silly. 
let's move on. <laughs> I should probably save. It's been a while since I saved. All right. Um, I'm trying to find a grove. Like? Oh God. How long can you people continue to sit by and claim you protect us, protectors? Ha! You sit in your enclave, safe from the Mandalorians, while we suffer. What are you talking about? Brutes have killed my daughter. Always gotta to save before big story points. Blood. Sometimes it's but cool to Ilsa. save in a different save my file Ilsa. so you can go back Said just no. in case. Yeah, I've never really been in the habit of doing that. Um, well, actually, no. In this game, it's this is the game where I've done multiple save files the most. I probably could have done one before picking what type of Jedi I wanted to be. Whoops. Oh, well. <laughs> Really, I have it. Ilsa. My Ilsa said no. Only an idiot says no when they have a gun in their face. Oh my god. Uh, they killed her? <laughs> there was nothing I could do. Too many of the Mandalorians and their Doros allies. I've come here to ask you, please, Master Jedi, stop these raiders and get revenge for my daughter. Um. <clears throat> Maybe you can make it worth my while. I will give you all I have. Just please annihilate them from the face of this planet. You got <laughs> more dark side points. <laughs> oh my god. What am I doing? Oh, I can only go this way. Okay. I can't, uh, where am I? Oh, I guess I passed it. Oh, I totally did pass it. All right, let's go this way. So I'm looking for this grove. You guys look fun. I should probably talk to you guys. Let's talk to you. Not heavily armed enough. Oh no. A simple merchant with a much noble purpose. Uh, noble, are you? You're trying to sell me something, aren't you? I used to play RPGs all the time, and so after having lost many hours of work, I became very safe-centric. It depends on the game for me, um, where I get, where I save a lot. Um, you cannot draw on the drop if someone already has their gun pointed at you and your gun is still in the holster, it's not going to end well. <laughs> Video games video games that does not really matter for the most part but in real life for sure imagine you could save in real life oh my god that would that would be great <laughs> you got hurt but saved boom go back and everything is fine <laughs> you made a mistake like on a financial decision or something just revert <laughs> uh weaponry okay let me see what you're selling Whoa! Can I buy this stuff? No! This stuff is expensive! <clears throat> Ooh, light repeating blaster. Ooh, I'll take grenades though. What you got? 
Uh, and I'll take... What's an adhesive grenade? Ooh, a gooey bioadhesive that traps anyone caught within the effects. It quickly degrades, though, allowing allies to zoom past unhindered. Oh, they're entangled for 15 seconds. That's fun. I'll take two. And then I'll take two ion grenades. And yeah. Oh, let me see if I can sell some things. I don't need this. We can sell that. I don't need that. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Oh, I have a lot of things I can sell. Um, don't need that. Don't need that. Because those were extra things I had. Um, I should probably see if I can upgrade some weapons. I forgot to check that. Or some armor. Um, I'll sell the mines because I don't use them ever. Use a data pad. Can I sell a data pad? No, not really. Um, I think... I guess that's good for now. Um, I can probably get rid of... I can get rid of the vibro blade. What's this? Vibro double blade? Oh, okay, I'll get rid of the vibro sword. And I have blasters, so I can probably just get rid of all of these. I'll keep the ion stuff, though. And then, um... Yeah, we'll do that. Cool. See ya! Well, might as well talk to this person now. Greetings, young Jedi. I wonder if you could assist me. I seem to have lost my... Even small companion. bubbles of time you rewind see? is incredibly useful. Who's your companion? We were working on my Even the weakest work. mind abilities can be incredible. In Let's outside, consider one that makes you think inside. insanely fast while under pressure. Most open, fights have a lot of muscle memory and intuitive striking and or grabs. But if you could I just calmly break everything down, it would be intense. I worry so much. I need him back so bad. For games like this, I wonder if for he, like D and D, they should allow players to take twenty on some skills when they should not be able to add with very little time. Like searching a room that takes minutes. Floor to ceiling takes eight minutes, but takes you six seconds. Reminds me of Prince of Persia, Sands of Time, the ability to rewind and retry something. Yeah, really. I wasn't listening. I searched everywhere and could not find him. I worry so much. I need him back so badly. I wonder if he could have been kidnapped. Sure, it's possible. Maybe it was the Mandalorians. Or maybe cat hounds. But no, cat hounds are not intelligent enough to open doors. Although they have been more vicious lately. It must have been someone who could open the door by himself. Come to think of it, the door was locked. Um, could someone have bypassed the lock? The door was undamaged and showed no signs of tampering. Could it have opened from the inside? Well, yes, it could have, but he had no reason to run away. Oh, did he now? It's programming. Oh, this is a droid? Well, yes. But he is very valuable to me all the same. He's the last piece of my poor passed away husband that I have left. He is very If I'm getting another droid companion, I should have saved those extra droid parts then. Beep 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 boop. Yes, T3, I understand you're concerned about him too. <laughs> I do not understand you, T3. Um What exactly did you use him for again? He is a personal assistance droid. My husband was a genius at constructing droids. He made this one capable of taking care of me for the rest of my life. As the last legacy of my husband, for my own personal ease of mind, I need him back. His absence gnaws at me like a gaping wound. Wow, she really misses her droid, doesn't she? <laughs> I was just gonna I say that! <laughs> alright, 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 I'll help him, I'll help him! I'll help you! Thank you, Thank you Master Jedi. If you find him. It's really weird to be called a Master Jedi now. So much. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. I'm just trying to get to this grove, but now I... The heck are you? 
Are you a calf hound? Oh, fudge. Uh-huh. Um... Eh, the name's in the way. Uh, T3, I want you to use a flamethrower. <laughs> Cause it's awesome! Oh cool, I stunned that one! Yay! Not too bad, not too bad. Am I going the right way though? What is this? Path south, right? I'm supposed to go south. Grove to the southeast, yes. So let's go down here. Oh, that's kind of southwest. But we'll give it a shot. Open field! What's here? What's this? What's that? Okay, never mind. Oh, there are people here. Let's say hi. Oh, Mandalorians, let's save. We're gonna save. Hello? You've been holding out on us again. If you haven't given us enough money, I guess we're gonna have to take it out of you piece by piece. Hey, little no, Jedi. Please. Hi, Vinny! Wife and children instead. We made it out of Terrace, Vinny! Now I'm a Jedi. <laughs> You mean we're gonna shoot you? Do the no, not the not the disruptor. Do do the do the flamethrower, cause it's cool. And then attack, Karth. Uh, you can attack this guy. Do the thing. Now that oh, I'm getting kicked at. Oh, this is not. Um, yeah, Karth, go ahead and fin help with this Mandalorian. Oh shoot, you need- you need a repair kit? I should've bought more of those, cause I keep forgetting that T3 doesn't use med packs. Fudge! Um... We're fine, we're fine. I might lose T3 though. Oh good, I still have T3. Uh, T3, what do you got? Oh, you're already using it, that's fine. Uh, can you use this flamethrower some more? Cause that's cool. I want a droid with a flamethrower, that'd be awesome. Hey, journal entry edit. That's fun. Oh, hi, I'm being attacked still. <laughs> no big deal. Flame that guy! Go T3, go! Oh, you don't need to flame him anymore. Then flame that guy! Where are you going? T3! Burned alive! I'm here. Yeah! <laughs> loot, loot, loot! Yeah, loot! Hello, credits! Oh, can I have this? Can I? Can I have? Oh, I can't jump. That's the pause button. I want this. It will make it so much easier to travel. Oh, some remains here. What you got, Mando? Ooh, that looks fun. What is that? 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 Ooh, I'm gonna heal myself. Yeah! I can heal myself! Uh... <laughs> really excited about that. <laughs> here it is. What are you? Interesting. One to eight. A blaster rifle. Okay, fun, 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 fun. Am I going the right, wrong way? Uh, looks like it's this way. Hey, la, 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 la. she's a master Jedi, supreme gold deluxe with droid add-on features. It's ridiculous. He shot him so many times, and he's just cool with it. I know. Be sure to buy repair kits soon. Don't forget. Yeah. Ah, I found the grove. Okay, we'll save here. And, uh, let's go. This will probably, this grove thing will probably be the last thing. Hello! 
<coughs> that I do for tonight. Since we're getting closer to 8 o'clock now. Um, T3! Uh, flamethrower! Everything! Uh, Karth. Karth, Karth, Karth. You know what? A frag grenade probably wouldn't hurt. Do that. And then, um... You can, you can, yeah. And then, actually, back to Karth. Because you're gonna throw... Throw the grenade! And then, and then shoot. Good. 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 Uh, okay. 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 Let's do... Let's do this. Oh, oh, you look terrifying. Um... What is Karth attacking? Yes, attack that. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I lost T3. I was trying to see if I can get him to do a repair kit, kit soon. But uh, that's not happening. So this is gonna be fun. Um, all right. Actually. Energy shield. Then keep attacking. Uh, oh, I should have... I don't. I do. I don't. That's okay. I thought I had a defense thing. Oh no, no, I think that's passive, so never mind. Now that yeah, I stunned him! Okay, 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 okay. Uh, Karth, you're now going to attack. Yeah, 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 you can attack that guy. Um, you also attack. And then we're gonna watch Karth's health here. Oh, 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 ah! Um, he's getting, he's getting stomped on. Let's try, let's try a med pack. Maybe five. <laughs> and then what is Karth attacking? That one. Ready. Stay alive, Karth! He's still losing. <laughs> uh -huh. Now that must have been Yeah! Alright. Um, you need more med packs. Are you curing him? I'm here. I think she cured herself. That's kind of all right. Now that must be. We did. We we okay? You okay? You're not okay. <laughs> I'm out of med packs. That's great. Um, oops. So you're in. Yeah, I'm in Dantooine right now. I'm trying to. Uh, uh I don't even remember what I'm doing. Do you like the Shadowrun games? If you play a rigger, you can get at least two robots working for you, and it's great. I haven't heard of them. I like monster taming, sending mini, mini monsters. Me too! Me too! Um, well, well, Karth, it's been fun. I think you still have a shield up, though. So, hopefully that helps. I don't know why you're attacking that one. I want you to attack that one. Let's go! I'm about to lose Karth. There, I lost Karth. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay, I lost. We're good on that. Let's do this shield. Those things look like they might be good to eat. Maybe. <laughs> Alright, come on. Come on. You can do it. Um, hold on. Life support pack? Antidote kit. Life support. I don't know what this life support thing is. Um, here's, we're gonna run a little bit, because we're gonna try to throw a grenade. Oh, he's just right behind me, like, no big deal. Um, how do I get force depleted? Can it grow? Is it is it growing back? 
Oh no. Ah, I healed myself! Perfecto! Okay. Attack this dude. Go! Now that must be Almost Oh yes! Now he's stunned! I am so glad I took that trick! Uh, those look like the- oh, they might be good to eat really angry sharp tooth trihorn bulls. <laughs> oh, hi T3! You're live! Hey Karth, buddy! Good job! <laughs> I can't- I can heal T3, but I can't heal Karth! My bad! Sorry! You might, uh, uh, okay. <laughs> Let's save. And, um... Sandral Grounds? Is that where I'm heading? Looks like it. Fun! I believe this is where I need to be. Hello, what's up? This is private property. By what authority are you trespassing on this estate? Um My weapons are my authority. But I may not open the gates except for those other people's family business. I don't think this is where I'm supposed to be. You will not be able to get in. And tomorrow another drawing will be programmed to take over my duties. You must cleanse a meditation grove to the southeast of the dark taint that has been infesting it. Did I go the wrong way? Door. I might have gone the wrong way. North. Sandral Estate. Or do I just go around? Oh, nope. Uh, not there. What about the other way? This door! Nope. Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, is this a path this way? Be okay. Okay, I probably should have planned that a little better because I have people that are dying, but whatever. Uh, shoot, hold on. And then flamethrower. Uh, I think I killed a few of them. It's just hard to tell which ones. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's go with attacking this guy because he's right in my face. Yeah, you keep attacking that guy too, and T3, you go for that. Now that oh my god, I gotta disengage, move Korth, and cure. All right, back to this guy. Oh, the cure healed both her and Karth. That's nice. Where are you guys going? Um. No. I want you to do this, and then this, and then attack. And Karth, you poor person. You just need to... Stay alive. Almost, almost. 
Who went down? Karth did. Okay. This was maybe a bad idea. Oh, fudge! Go back, T3! Go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back! Pause. Where are, uh... Do you have a shield up? Wait. What is hap- That one's almost dead. Can we just throw the grenade on that one? not good. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! They're back, but they're just gonna go down again! Oh no, I want- I want that one dead. Can we try to get that one dead first, please? Oh, I guess that one's almost dead, though, too. Wait, there are more of them! Are they, like, respawning? I feel like they're practically respawning. Oh, I'm gonna die here. We're gonna disengage. Bye, T3. Run, running, all the running. <laughs> oh no, are they still following me? No, I don't think so. Okay! Can I have my friends back? Are you eating my friends? <gasps> okay. Those look like remains. Oh, no, it's just T3. Okay! This is a good stopping point! <laughs> we're gonna go back. <laughs> and then, um, we're gonna try again next time. Uh, yeah, you've only got... I don't know why I'm in what? combat mode, but okay. But, um, we're just gonna- we're- I'm gonna head back to where, uh, that vendor person was. And, um, just so that I can get, like, more... Path North. Or can I return to- oh, return to the Ebon Hawk. Let's do that. Heal up. Alright, we're gonna save here. And we will figure out this grove thing next time. But! We are off of Terrace! Woo! <laughs> so exciting. So, um... Wow, yeah, that was- that was something. Um, hold on. A lot of the time in games you'll find that people are very easily mesh a couple animals. That people very easily mess a mesh a couple animals and such together and bam, that's a new move minion for you to kill. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Today, shark tooth bulls, tomorrow, vorpal bunnies. So one thing you would think just be extremely common with all this high-end technology, you would explore worlds from your spaceship by controlling one or more droids, rarely ever risking yourself self-harm. Yep, sounds right. Uh, so, we're gonna end tonight. And, um, so I just want to say thank you guys for joining, as always, on this stream. It's a lot of fun, and I hope you guys are, uh, entertained by the antics and shenanigans that I am causing. And, um, I thoroughly enjoy this game. This is, this is great. Uh, I, I always can't wait to keep playing it, so I'm always excited to do these every Friday. Um... Next time, oh, oh, tomorrow, tomorrow, Saturday morning, um, we will have, uh, good old Matt here, part of Adventure Check, um, doing a stream on here tomorrow for, yes, thank you for posting the schedule, um, his DM prepping for his, uh, Monday campaign, so you can kind of see a little behind the scenes of what it's like to, to prep for a D&D &D session. And then the rest of us as a whole will be back on uh, Tuesday to continue our, um, oh geez, our Adventures in Middle Earth campaign. Yay, DM prepping, I really enjoy creation streams. Yeah! So be sure to catch that tomorrow morning. 
Um, and then, like I just said, we'll be back Tuesday to just kind of do the whole thing all over again for the week. And I'll be painting on Wednesday also. And then I'll be back here next Friday playing KOTOR. So, without further further ado i hope you guys enjoy a uh the rest of your friday i hope it's a good one uh celebrate the start of the weekend i hope you guys have a really great weekend uh stay warm if you are hitting getting hit by snow here in the u.s or elsewhere um it really sucks right now <laughs> but uh hang in there stay warm hope you guys all have power and whatnot and um past that i will see you guys next time. Bye!